two strands twist install so i'll just be taking you guys on the journey with me and as usual if you have any questions put them in the comment and i'll be happy to join in in the discussion so my client here had um started off with coil locks right mm -hmm. started off with coil locks and um the uh it just she said every time she would shampoo her hair and her hair is very soft you guys like it's so soft <laughs> so yeah i can see why every time you shampoo your hair it unraveled because you have very soft hair um so she's never had any other how long did you keep the coils in before you took them out mm, about i want to say about 10 weeks 10 weeks okay so, and how many times did you shampoo it during that time? Mm -hmm. three. three times? Mm -hmm. Okay. Shampooed her hair three times during that time. And it came out every time. Mm -hmm. And then the person who was doing it had to put the coils in every time. Mm -hmm. Back in every time. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And do you work out? Uh, oh, so, yeah. So, <laughs> it was probably already unraveling. Yes. During the workout. Yes. Yeah. So, coils is a great way to start your locks. Um, it's quick, it's convenient, um, it, it costs less because it takes less time, but it does not hold as well. Um, so if you have a very active lifestyle, coils isn't the best way to start your locks. Because if you work out, you swim a lot, it ain't going to stay. Because what's holding the, pro the um, coils together is the product. So if you don't know what I'm talking about by coils, you... I'm sure you can look it up and you'll see. Um, but it's pretty much, you use a comb where you can use your fingers to wrap the hair around itself. And it's products that's holding it together. So I'm just doing my initial parting to get the locks, um, to get my foundation. So, and then we'll start.
two strands twist. Some people twist. I twist going to the right side. Some people twist going to the left. Some people could do both. I can do both, but the left slows me down if I twist going to the left. So I twist going to the right. That's what's most comfortable for me. Does it matter when it comes to the lock? No. So as long as it's twisted, that's all that matters. Now, some people twist, then like roll it in their fingers, then twist. Uh, we're not doing rope twists here. We're just twisting. Um, if you're rolling it, then twisting, it, it's, it makes it tighter, but it's going to fluff out anyway. So why put in that extra work when, you know, it's just going to fluff out, so. I just put a little bit of foam, not a whole bunch, because I'm not trying to, you know, saturate it too much. Then I separate. Typically this row I would normally do four, but because her hairline is fine, I'm doing three. Three locks, that is, instead of four. I know some of y'all all about the numbers, but you want to make sure you have quality over quantity, okay? You don't want unhealthy locks. Thank you.